Okay, welcome back to another video on frequency distributions. Uh, in this video, we're going to find the median using a graphing calculator. Uh, in the previous video, or in one of the previous videos, we actually found the median of this using uh, the long way uh, by doing it by hand. Now we get the graphing calculator. So, the first thing you're going to do is you're going to find the stat button here and click on that. It's going to say edit, uh, so just press enter. Now, you may have things in these lists here. So what you're going to do is if you do highlight the L1 and L2, so highlight L1, you're going to get the list here, you just clear it, and then just press enter, and it will clear that list. So do it again for L2, press enter, and there you go. All right, in the left-hand column, it has to mimic or mirror this thing, or this table here. So in the left-hand column will be your GPAs. So we have 2.1, uh, 2.75, 3.2, 3.5, 3.75, and 4. All right, so now we'll go put in the frequency. So that's going to be four people who have a 2.1, 26 who have a 2.75, and so on. Just make sure that it looks like your frequency distribution. All right, so there we go. Now what you're going to do is you're just going to press second quit. Uh, if there's anything on your screen, just clear it out. Now what you're going to do is go back to the stat button again, uh, scroll over to this one variable stats, press center, and you are then going to press second, L1, that was L4. All right, sorry, second, one, to get L1. So that's your left-hand column, then you press comma, and then your second, or your right-hand column, which is then L2. Okay, whichever one you put in the left-hand column, this could be like L3 and L4. Uh, it doesn't always have to be L1 and L2. As long as this first list is your GPA and your second list is the frequency. Press Enter. Okay, so we do have a mean here, which is 3.16. That's not what we were trying to find, but it's good to know. That's the mean GPA. All right, what you're going to do is you're going to scroll down. You see this little arrow here? It says scroll down. Uh, scroll down a little bit. And there's the median right there, which is 3.2. If you watch the previous video, we, f we find that the median is 3.2. Uh, we also find that the frequency was 92, which meant that the median was between the 46th and 47th. Um, if you learned about quartile deviations, that's what this Q1 and Q3 are for. Uh, but we're not going to do any of that in this video. Um, so it's really, a, it was just a short video. Uh, there's not much to finding the median or mean of a frequency distribution. As long as you know how to enter everything in to your lists, you should be good.